know, the meaning of the art for me doesn't rely on the artist, and it doesn't rely on the painting, and it doesn't rely on the audience. It's a conversation between the three. My name is Selena Rosas. I feel the farther I am from Mexico, the most Mexican I am, because I miss it so much. I compare everything, every situation, every word. I miss the whole atmosphere. I don't have it here. I brought everything with me. Things that you don't pack in a bag, in a suitcase. I brought fear. I brought the hustle. I brought the noise. <laughs> now I live in the Czech Republic in a town very close from Prague. You get highly influenced all the time, at least I do. Being here, discovered Czech artists or European artists. I was never so close to communism and it's not a communist country anymore, but the whole history, the perspective totally changed. You get totally influenced. You, you get to see other things that you, at least I haven't ever planned before. How would be a communist Mexico? I don't have this specific moment, a specific point in my life where I was like, I want to be an artist. But it was hard for me to make the step to say, well, maybe, maybe I can create art too. At the beginning, I thought it was going to be joyful, but unfortunately, maybe, not every time is joyful. Sometimes I'm, everybody does this, you know, not only artists, everybody, something happens to you in your life, you cannot carry that for long. You have to process it. You have to let it out of your body. Right now, I'm really into Teresa Margolles. Well, Teresa is Mexican and she's talking about violence in Mexico. So it's a topic I'm researching on. So I, I feel connected to her just because we are women, we are alive, we're Mexican. I used to dance. I used to dance a lot. And I'm not that far of doing it with my paintings. I go around, move my body. I find motivation in being curious about myself, about what's coming next. And what keeps me painting, even though there's, there's this up and downs because of my confidence. I don't have it every day. Sometimes I hate it so much. I think that's the difference, you know, it's not a constant feeling. It's not like you buy a canvas and try to make a landscape by this, this nice, this, this stressful moment that for me is not happening because it's a process. So that's the up and downs. But what keeps me going through the up and downs is being curious about how art is going to manifest through me the day I am zero confident about myself and the day I am the happiest and the proudest of myself. Si no me pudiera expresar de esta manera, me sentiría en limbo, estancada.